Hey guys, and welcome to I Want My Angst TV Reviews. I'm Sarah, and today we are gonna be talking about the new HBO Max CBC original, sort of. Sort of is a fantastic series that is written and stars Bilal Bag. Sort of tells the story of a queer, non-binary, female presenting person of color named Sebi. And Sebi goes on this incredible journey of self-acceptance, of self-discovery, all while going through outside personal drama. Are you just gonna avoid mom's calls forever? Not a fair question. She calls me way more than she calls you. Because I have a real job. Mom, I'm a nanny. Like Mary Poppins? sort of is hilarious with so much heart that I could not stop watching. What I love about it is it's much more of like personal comedy versus something that goes for all the jokes. And what I mean by that is it's kind of like girls or Fleabag. It's not like New Girl, right? Where a series like that, which is great, kind of goes for joke after joke after joke, where this show, the jokes come more natural and just kind of out of the happenstance of what's happening. I mean, that's redundant. You don't see me. What are you talking about? I mean, you don't see him. Whatever. He'll come feel letting me drag this stuff out of you. I'm never comfy. You just have military grade interrogation tactics. And since sort of is written by a person of color in the queer community, they're able to tackle subjects that you wouldn't be able to otherwise. Sebi comes from a Pakistani family and so does Bilal, so they're able to write from a personal perspective of what it's like to be a non-binary female presenting, possibly trans person of color. And they're able to tackle issues like gender, gender fluidity, trans issues, life issues from a different perspective that I found enthralling while not being overhanded. It makes this show very palatable for those who know nothing about the community, who are curious about the community, or those that just want to watch and have a good time. Sort of, for me, is also very much more a dark comedy. Not so much a dark comedy, but like a dramedy. The entire story comes from a tragedy from the family that Sebi nannies. Violet Henry School. Bessie got into an accident on her bike. Sebi was originally going to school to be an electrician, but then decided that that wasn't for them and they want to figure out what they want to do with their life. And so they become a nanny to this amazing family. And the mother has an accident in the very first episode and is in a coma throughout the entire time. What you learn and my biggest complaint about the series is that I wish we had more scenes with Sebi and the mother before this accident because their scenes are beautiful and heartfelt and full of love and acceptance. And you really see that they cared for each other and had a great friendship. And it explains why Sebi may not have gone to Berlin with their best friend, Seven. Sacrificing yourself for a part-time nanny gig. You break my heart! And I found Bilal's writing to be so fun and joyful and significant and full of so much heart that I really hope that this series takes off and we get a season two. The way this series ends, it could end this way, but there is a bit of a cliffhanger that I really wanna see where all of these characters that I have fallen in love with go because they're phenomenal and so fun. Dad said non-responsive. Non-responsive can mean a lot of things, like when you don't respond to a text. You are a fucking separate wife. Totally. I'm totally Nicole Kidman. <sighs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, I'm Sarah. Make sure you check out Sort Of. I promise you, you won't regret it. Comment below, let me know what you think when you do. Subscribe to this channel, give this video a thumbs up and ring that bell so don't miss out on any more angsty videos.